Swedish death cleaning sounds like something scary, but many people are adopting it. So I know it sounds really dark and extremely gloomy and morbid, but it's actually not. It's a staple in Swedish culture that suggests folks over 50 years old start to organize their homes and possessions. And now it's making its way to America. It's essentially minimalism. There's an author named Margareta Magnusson, and she wrote a book called The Gentle Art of Swedish Death Cleaning. The concept is simple. Purge the unnecessary things in your life so your loved ones don't have to do it when you're gone. Then you can make room for the things that actually do matter. Interior designer Bridgette Thomas is giving us the 101 on how you can try it for yourself. First, take everything out of storage. Everyone basically has their version of a junk drawer. The author suggests taking all of your things out of storage units and any storage areas of your home, like the attic or garage, and getting rid of it all. Get rid of it, donate it to a good cause, Trash it if it's not valuable, but purge. You can even give your meaningful collectibles to friends and family so they can enjoy and appreciate your items while you're still around. Once you've emptied your storage, the author says to go through each item in your home and determine if it makes you happy. To ask yourself, does this bring happiness to my life? Am I a better person? Am I happier? Is my life more fulfilled because of this item? If the answer is no, you get rid of it. It's unnecessary, it's not adding to your life, you don't need it. The book advises people to get rid of all harmful things that may hurt a loved one, like an old love letter from an old flame. And finally, keep only one box. Treat yourself to one box. So in this box, all of those things that matter to you, but maybe only you. The key factor about this box is that you write in big, bold lettering, toss after death. Then family members will know what to do with it when you're gone. It may sound sad, but the author says this minimalist lifestyle can reduce stress and enhance your quality of life. You treat yourself at the end of it all, and it's worth it. Your home is clutter-free, your life is clutter-free, and you have room for new things and things that matter to you. Cleaning your closet like there's no tomorrow on the top of the list.